Hey everyone, welcome back to Measure and Mix. Today I'm doing an open collab video hosted by Lacey Space. Uh, she asked us to do a DIY thrifted cake stand. So that is what I'm going to do for you today. Um, if you haven't checked out her channel, I will leave a link down below. And also I will leave a link to the playlist down below once it's available. So you can go check that out after you're done with my video. Alright, what I found to make a cake stand out of was I actually found two things, that, so I'm going to do two cake stands. Um, I think that's okay because <laughs> I really just fell in love with both of these items. Um, the first thing that I found was this pretty plate, um, from, this is all from Goodwill. It has like a little flower detail and some scalloped edges and I just thought it was really pretty and spring-like and I thought it would work well as a cake plate. Um, to go with that, I found this little silver candle holder and I just thought this would be really pretty together. So I'm going to clean both of these items up. I'm not going to do anything else but clean them up and then put them, um, glue them together. Um, and then the next item that I found to make a cake plate was just this uh, cream colored plate and it has the scallops edge detail. I, I like that look as you can tell. Um, but I thought it was just kind of, just real simple but it kind of had that farmhouse feel to it. So I'm going to just clean this plate up. And then the stand for it I found was this little glass candle holder and I fell in love with it because it had these little like little bubble um, on the edge of it and I just thought it was so cute. Now I could probably just leave this and this the same way but what I think I'm going to do is I have the same color of paint as the plate so I'm going to go ahead and chalk paint this um, to match the plate just so that it looks like one cohesive piece. Um, and then put them together. So I'm gonna go clean these up and then I'll show you how I put them together and you'll see what it looks like. Okay, so this little silver candlestick is just a little bit like got some spots on it, um, a little tarnished, I guess. So I don't know. I'm gonna try this mixture that I found on Pinterest um, to try to clean it up a little bit better. All it is is a cup of boiling water and one tablespoon of baking soda mixed into the boiling water. And then you line your bowl with aluminum foil, place your item, your silver item in the bowl, and then just pour it over. And then it says to let it sit for five to 10 minutes. All right, so I've let this sit for about 10 minutes. I added another cup of water and some more, another teaspoon, tablespoon, sorry, of baking soda, um, just to try to get the top portion. And it looks good so far, but I'm just gonna give it a rinse and wipe it down. Um, and then hopefully that kinda helped clean it off a little bit. Well guys, I think that really helped a lot. Like it looks so much better. Um, it really took the tarnish off. It's really shiny now. And it's gonna be so pretty with my um, plate on top of it. All right, so I'm gonna start out by painting the glass piece. And I'm gonna use this lace color chalky finish paint by Deco Art Americana Decor. Um, I'm just gonna paint that on the glass and then after I'm done, I'm gonna use 
this finishing wax to polish it and make sure I seal it. And it'll kind of give it a little bit of a shine like the plate has. this candlestick dries with the first coat of paint, I'm going to go ahead and attach the, this plate to this candlestick. I'm going to use just hot glue. Normally I would use E6000 because it would um, last longer and be a stronger bond, but I don't have any available right now, so hot glue will do the trick for now. All painted now I ended up using some polyacrylic to seal it instead of just the clear wax just to give it a little bit more of a shiny coat to match the plate um, now all I'm gonna do is adhere the plate to the candlestick and I'm gonna use my hot glue again Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of my DIY thrifted cake stands. Just so you know, I put a lemon blueberry bunk cake with cream cheese frosting on the white stand and I put butter cookies on the stand with the flowers on it. And I will link the recipes down below. They were super easy to make and they taste delicious. Um, I love how this turned out. If you guys did too, please give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to check out Lacey's channel. Um, and thank you again so much to her for hosting this collab. It was awesome and really fun. I had a great time doing it. Um, also, if you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell too so you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. Alright guys, that is all I have for you. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.